This collaboration represents a great achievement and a proud moment in the history of two, our two nations. And the liftoff of the Falcon 9 rocket and the Dragon spacecraft that packed the science and supplies. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. It is also a reminder to all of us that in a, within a greater um, universe, there are actually no boundaries, no limits. And as such, there should be no boundaries to the friendship between Japan and Kenya. We endeavor to build on this success to develop a strong aerospace and satellite program which will constitute part of what we hope will be a sophisticated te technology uh, and technological capability and that our economy will become technology driven and that we shall also become much more competitive in the world as a result. I'm encouraged that this venture by the scientists from the University of Nairobi is the beginning of an inspirational journey for Kenyans into the study of space science related technologies and innovations for the development of our economy. The remote sensing devices that was even launched today is able to check the atmosphere, the humidity, the sea surface temperatures and even the movement of winds and prediction of that weather will be done. Dear colleagues from Kenya, Turkey, Tarika, for the successful satellite deployment. It's a great step uh, made by the Kenyan uh, scientific world and it will go a big step in even uh, making things like uh, the storms and even the, the what happened recently, the flooding, to be checked before they happen. Mm. Wow. Uh, to me, it was a very great experience launching the satellite. First of all, I'm a CS student, computer science, so like it was a very interesting thing for me because it's when I thought Kenya and like the rest of the world and universities to do research. Yeah.